Oh my god. Space aliens. Don't eat me! I have a wife and kids! Eat them! Silence! We are travelers from a certain nearby ringed planet whose name we'd prefer not to mention. My name is Kang. And this is my sister, Kodos. Hello. I suppose you want to probe me. Well, might as well get it over with. Stop. We have reached the limits of what rectal probing can teach us. This is a mission of conquest. Oh, would you look at that? Kneel ah! before my slingshot, puny earthling. Well, I guess my first wish is to get rid of those awful aliens. Ah, he's got a board with a nail in it. And save humanity, will ya? Run, Kodos. <laughs> well, Kang, it seems the Earthling won. Did they? That board with the nail in it may have defeated us, but the humans won't stop there. They'll make bigger boards and bigger nails. Soon they will make a board with a nail so big it will destroy them all. <laughs> what the book's about. Quiet. We're missing the dissection. Actually, I'm still alive, so technically it's vivisection. No one likes to know it all. <laughs> Hello. Oh, great. Mormons. Actually, we're quantum Presbyterians, and we've come to see my daughter. Oh, Lord. I was hoping this day would never come. Huh? What are you talking about? You mean you never told him? <sighs> I guess I've been in denial. Homer, Kang is Maggie's father. You intergalactic hussy! How could you? <laughs> was he better than me? It all happened about two years ago. There I was, having a great time in the backyard, when without warning, I was abducted by aliens. Warning! Warning! Prepare to be abducted! <laughs> Congratulations! You have been selected for our cross-breeding program. To put you at ease, we have recreated the most common spawning locations of your species. You may choose either the back seat of a Camaro, an airplane bathroom, a friend's wedding, or the alley behind a porno theater. I absolutely refuse to go along with this. But since I have no choice, I'll take the alley. Initiate fertilization procedure. Ah. Oh, you look lovely this evening. Have you decreased in mass? I tried to resist, but they applied powerful mind confusion techniques. Look behind you. Insemination complete. Really? That seemed awfully quick. What are you implying? Nothing, nothing. Whoa, wow, look at the time. I'd love to stay, but I have an early meeting tomorrow. You're a super girl, though. I'll call you sometime. Nine months later, I gave birth to Maggie. And now she must return home to Rigel 7, where she will be guaranteed a lucrative civil service job for life. Well, we can't compete with that, but, but nothing. Get your slimeless hands off her. People, people, space monsters, this is going nowhere. There's only one man who can settle an argument this bizarre. Okay, we're back. Homer, how did it feel to learn your baby was fathered by a drooling space octopus? It made me angry, Jerry. Angry and tired. Well, you're about to get a whole lot angrier because we have the extramarital, extraterrestrial backstage in a soundproof booth where he can't hear us. I hear all. Ladies and gentlemen, meet Kang. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Well, hyperbolic paraboloid. Oh, yo, mama. Yeah, I got a question for that gross thing, whatever it is. Homer. Nah, the green dude. If you're that baby's daddy, where you been at? 
You know, somebody needs to learn your green ass some responsibility. Yeah. Now, hold on, Kang. You can't bully my audience with your fancy ray gun. Yeah. And now for my final thought. Nobody wins when parents put their petty squabbles above the welfare of a child. Let's hope they put their differences aside and do what's best for Maggie. What the f Get the baby off, son of a I'm so embarrassed. The politics of failure have failed. We need to make them work again. Tomorrow, when you are sealed in the voting cubicle, vote for me, Senator K Bob Dole. I am looking forward to an orderly election tomorrow, which will eliminate the need for a violent bloodbath. America, take a good look at your beloved candidates. They're nothing but hideous space reptiles. Oh. It's true. We are aliens. But what are you going to do about it? It's a two-party system. You have to vote for one of us. He's right. This is a two-party system. Well, I believe I'll vote for a third-party candidate. Go ahead. Throw your vote away! <laughs> All hail President K! I don't understand why we have to build a ray gun to aim at a planet I never even heard of. Don't blame me. I voted for Kodos. 